Today I'm gonna to show you how to make my five cheese mac and cheese. First you wanna boil your macaroni noodles until they're al dente. And then you wanna shred your cheese. Right here I'm shredding a smoked Gouda, really, really good cheese. And then also a Havarti cheese. This is a great melting cheese. It's really, really creamy. And then I have my Velveeta that I'm cubing. And then I'm also cubing some um, cream cheese also gives macaroni a very creamy silky texture and then I have here some shredded sharp shredded cheese so now I'm going to add in a few tablespoons of butter and also a couple tablespoons of flour to make a roux I'm going to stir that until I get that raw flour flavor out and then I'm going to um, add in some milk you want to continue to stir during this process because you don't want any lumps and clumps in your cheese sauce Next, I'm gonna add in some heavy cream. Again, this gives the cheese sauce a silky, um, just a creamy texture. If you're on a diet, you might wanna skip <laughs> making this macaroni and cheese. Next, I'm gonna season my cheese sauce um, with salt and pepper. Make sure you season it to your liking and you can go ahead and add in your cheeses. You definitely don't have to use the cheeses that I use. You can use any type of cheese that you like. These will happen to be my favorite cheeses to use in macaroni and cheese. And stir all those beautiful cheeses together. And after a couple minutes, this is what you get. Glorious. And now you wanna combine your cheese sauce and your noodles together. Get an oven safe dish and go ahead and put your mac and cheese in there. I don't like a super hard crust on my mac and cheese, so I'm only gonna add a little bit of sharp cheddar on the top. Baked in the oven for about 35 minutes at 350. And there you have it, creamy, delicious macaroni and cheese. If you give it a try, let me know what you think. Don't forget to like and subscribe.